what you know about me? What you what you know about me? I'm honestly like super impatient. Like when I want something, I want it like right then and there. I really do not like to wait for stuff. I'm back, bro. Like if I'm gonna get the content, I'm gonna get the content. What's up, what's up, what's up, what's up, what's up? Hey y'all. Sorry, I um didn't get to finish getting ready. I take my mom to work. But I, I'm a, probably gonna do a, a, what's it called? a bun today. I look so naked without all my jewelry. Anyway, um, I um, was just thinking about, you know, me launching my business this summer. Um, just how I wanna go about it and like just not letting, Letting things make me nervous, let, letting the idea make me nervous. Um, and you know, just because like the market that I'm going into is, 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 um, it's big. Like a lot of people are doing it, have been doing it for a really, really, really long time. And um, that kind of makes me nervous. That kind of just, you know, makes me feel like it won't be successful but i know it will be successful as long as i you know stay consistent and you know keep doing what i'm doing you know putting my time and stuff into it and um yeah so i was just thinking about um which i have already thought about it before but like business cards flyers and stuff so i live down the street from a college um so I'm gonna get business cards, you know, made and put them at at the university. I'm also gonna see if I can put them at nail shops because I literally just passed like three nail shops back to back. I'm gonna see if I can put my business cards there, put them at hair stores, you know, flyers and business cards at the hair store. Um, and where else do like girls go? Um, you know, just like putting it everywhere, putting my 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 business out everywhere, um, and you know, I just need to I just need to, you know, start getting more work done. I have a calendar, but I just I need to make use of the calendar. Like right now, my calendar just has like bills on it. But honestly, y'all, like I want my calendar to be full. Like, I really do want it to be full. I love being busy. I love being productive. I love having things to do. And I just need to make sure I have things to do. And, um, you know, I think one of those factors as to why I'm not is because I don't have a laptop. Well, I do have a laptop, but the keyboard broke. So it's just a tablet now. But I just, I feel like that I'm using that as an excuse to like not, you know, get things done. But like I have two phones and then I have a tablet as well. And then there's the library. Like I have options. Like there's no there's no excuse as to why, you know, things aren't getting done. Um another thing is just because like this past week I have been extremely tired really not even this past week this past month i've been so freaking tired like last night of course i'm be tired i was up till two something in the morning talking to my best friend he is so icky so i was up to like two something in the morning had to get up at eight so i got a red bull about to go um make a pizza for breakfast but like I've just been so freaking tired and like when I'm done working and I get home, I as soon as I take my shower, like I'm ready to get in the bed. Like for real. Honestly, I do like minimum work when I'm in bed. But at the same time, like when I get home, I want to get in the shower. But I need to just sit for like I just need to do like an hour. Just give yourself an hour, Jay. To get some work done and then get your ass in the shower and then go to sleep. <laughs> you know, and if I if I'm sleeping in the morning, get the fucking red bull. But I have to start getting this shit done. Like, because I'm launching, I'm launching this summer. And I can't
can't launch this summer if things aren't together. I, I can't. So, I have to get things done. I, I am. I will. I am getting things done. I'm very proud of myself. I'm very excited. You know, and I just... I speak so much life into myself that I know that there's no way that I could fail. So, with that being said, an hour every night before I go to before I take my shower, an hour, and if it's even more than an hour, that's even better. But an hour minimum every day, every day, Jay. Whether that's con editing videos, I can really edit videos. And I tried to edit a video last night. I fell asleep. Whether that's editing videos, um, talking to vendors, um, making flyers, like whatever is for the brand, for my brand, for my business, that needs to be an hour minimum every single day, every single day, every single day, every single day. Because I was doing it. I was. But then, I, like I said, I've been so tired this whole month that i just been, like, working, coming home, taking my shower, and going straight to sleep. Like, trying to catch back up on sleep. But you going to lose sleep. Like, you going to lose sleep when you got shit to do. You going to lose sleep when you got dreams and goals that you need to accomplish, that you want to accomplish. You're going to lose sleep. And I don't mind. I will, I will drink a fucking Red Bull every day if I have to. I'm not going to because I heard Red Bulls are pretty unhealthy. But they get the job done, so it's okay. But I just, I cannot, like, continue to sleep on myself. Like, I, it's not fair to me. It's not fair to my family because this is who I'm doing it for. Like, it's just not fair. So, get get up. You know, get up. Put the work in. And that's not... And, and I'm talking to myself, but also to whoever. Like, if, you, if you're ready to start something, if you've been wanting to start something, if you've been wanting to do something, get your ass up. Put the work in. Like, because ain't nobody else going to do it for you. You have to want it for yourself. You have to do it yourself. So, get the fuck up. Put the work in and let's do this. Come on. I cannot wait to watch this video like a month from now and just be smiling because this is motivation. Like, and the fact that I'm going to watch it a month later or however long later and be like, you really did that shit. You really stuck to your word. You really did what you needed to do. Go shopping. <laughs> Go shopping, Jay, because you deserved it. Uh, I'm just proud of myself, and I'm I'm very excited. And like, there's no sleeping. There's no sleeping because I had I dream and think about this shit every single like when I say every minute of every day. This is on my mind. Like, there's no reason why things aren't getting done. And I'm not saying things aren't getting done, but minimum, minimum work is getting done. Like, I need to do more than a minimum. I need to be doing more. And that's, that's what I'm doing. I need to write that. I need to put an affirmation on here. Uh, and I have an affirmation right here that says, I'm not lazy. I make sure to get things done. Which I have been doing as far as like work, working and stuff. But I need to do it just for my business, my brand. Like, so what's what's my affirmation for that? I make time for my business. I am consistent with elevating my business I am the brand do y'all do affirmations I 
I put affirmations on my um windshield now. <laughs> what was my affirmations? I need to turn this down. But I like this song by Key Glock. <laughs> I am consistent with my business. This one says I'm so focused on bettering myself. <laughs> and I am. Like, all I do is elevate. I'm gonna keep this one right here. I am the blueprint. I'm the tool to get there. And then this one, money comes to me so fast and easy. Literally. Like, I am literally the money magnet. A money magnet. Like, all I do is go to the bank. I outdo myself every time. And do. I'm keeping this up here. No, I'm going to take it down. But I do outdo myself every time. I am consistent with my business. Um, I am the brand. I am the brand and it shows. I am the brand and it shows. Um, I'm the blueprint. I'm going to take this one down. I am the blueprint. I am the blueprint. I am the brand and it shows I am consistent with my business. I am motivated. I'm so motivated to succeed. one I can take this one down too but I'm not because I need to my last one is going to be um, I take care of my family I take care of myself and my family why I get like the voice in my head say God I take care of God, but God takes care of me. I take care of myself. I should have put my family in I. Like, get your... My English teacher, Miss G, she would have been on my ass. <laughs> my family. Because it's my family and I, not me and my family. But it's okay. I take care of myself and my family. I should have put my family so rich. That's going to be my next affirmation. I was uh, telling my best friend about my teeth yesterday. I was like, um, never mind, bro. I'm fucking tired of talking about my teeth. Like, that shit is so arrogant. Like, shut the fuck up. Literally, shut the fuck up. Just get the shit done. But I'm making my appointment um in March. And then by the time my birthday comes, I'm still gonna have braces, but um, my implants are gonna already be in. So that's a input. I need to put that on there too. My teeth are so pretty. My teeth are full. <laughs> Bitch, I'm so, uh, my teeth are full and so pretty. I'm done talking about my teeth. I'm taking this shit out. Like, as soon as I start talking about my teeth in this video, I'm, I'm deleting it all because shut up. Literally shut up. It's just annoying. Like, the fact that I realized realize everything is just annoying and i watched my one of my videos last night that i was that i need to drop i talk too fucking much that's why i'm gonna title it title it i talk too much but it's okay 
um i was basically just talking about my realization about like my teeth and how i allow people to get in my head and stuff and how it just made me a little disappointed in myself but i mean it is what it is anyway i hope whoever's watching this is having an amazing day i know i am i'm about to finish getting ready go to the veil damn i got paid 55 dollars 56 dollars from this order yesterday um yeah go to the veil start working get this dough and yeah damn it's saturday and i'm already i'm only 35 dollars away from my weekly goal i outdo myself every time When I tell y'all I'm, I'm already doing, I, I live in my affirmations. And it shows. What does that say? I am the brand. And it shows. There's no reason why. There's, anyway, y'all have a good ass day. So keep your prayers up. Read your Bible. I'm so sorry. Read your Bible. And, you know, keep living. Keep striving. Keep elevating. And yeah, bye y'all. How y'all doing? I'm doing good. Um, I'm literally just practicing intro because um, I just need to get it together, you know. Like, <coughs> as far as like how I'm taking this, um, how I'm taking YouTube. So I need to, um, you know, make my um, YouTube intro and outro. I need to have, like, you know, a saying. And my saying is rich in love, spirit, and wealth. What are you rich in? Because we are rich, you know. But I'm the rich girl. You're the rich girl or the rich boy, you know. I'm rich in love, spirit, and wealth. What are you rich in? I love that. Like, I literally love that. <laughs> I'm the rich girl. Um, I ain't doing nothing, y'all. I'm just working right now. I'm on my way to jump off an order. And I was just thinking of um, how I can, you know, like, make my content better or just, like, make it, period. Um, I downloaded a YouTube studio where I can see everything and so far I have 1.3 um, hours in watch time that's probably all for me that's probably all for me I ain't even go cap that shit is crazy but it's still exciting though um, I'm very excited um, so as far as um you know, like getting my content and just taking YouTube like serious, period. You know, having an intro and outro, having a saying, um, making making my videos interesting, titling my uh, videos The Rich Girl, and then like what the video is about. Um, putting little snippets in the beginning so I can go ahead and grasp people's attention instead of just being like, What's up, y'all? It's Jay, aka the Rich Girl. Where I'm rich in love, spirit, and wealth. What are you rich in? Um, that's gonna be the intro, but after like the snippets of what I'm doing, even though I'm not really doing anything, I'm just with pieces of like what I'm talking about. Because most of my videos are just talking videos or just me working. Because like that's all I do is work. I have been watching um like business videos. I've Literally, I'm always watching business videos all the time on YouTube. YouTube is literally like um, YouTube University. If you know, you know. So right now, I'm currently learning um, how to make a hair. I mean, um, how to make hair tags, hang tags, and like wraps and stuff. For my upcoming uh, hair business, um, where am I turning before I start? Okay, so so far I learned. Um, I seen someone using like this gun to um, 
do their bundles and stuff and i always wonder like what is that and where do i get that from i learned that that is a, a tagging gun that i can easily purchase from amazon so i'm gonna get that and then um um creating like my new design and new logo on canva because y'all when i say i have switched my um my name like five times like it her coat is cute I have switched my name five times, but now I'm set on it. And um, I need to go. I literally had made my designing logo for my last name. The last name that I had. But something about it just wasn't hidden to me. And then I came up with this. My uh, business is called The Rich Girl. The Rich Girl. Hair extensions. Where do you get your hair from? The rich girl. I am the rich girl. You get your hair from me. Luxury raw hair, quality hair. And when I say rich, I don't mean like rich. I mean, yes, I mean rich, but like rich in love, rich in spirit, which rich in wealth. Um, so that's what that means, the rich girl. But as far as like the rich girl hair extensions, it's just about having rich, luxur luxurious nice ass hair like and people are gonna ask like where did you get your hair from and people gonna say the rich girl don't that sound so far like i'm excited so i've been learning um just been learning like um a whole bunch of stuff about it i've been speaking to vendors and stuff and y'all finding a vendor is easy but finding the perfect vendor is tough that is hard i done had so many interviews with vendors i interview vendors like i interview vendors and i ain't gonna lie some of them are you know they're good vendors but they're not the type of vendors that i'm looking for like the type of hair that i want when i say luxurious rich hair that's exactly what i mean i want to provide i am i do provide um quality hair quality hair that lasts a long time quality hair that you can do any and everything with um people gonna know people gonna know and i don't want to just specialize in just like you know black people because you know black people wear hair and stuff i don't miss my turn that's okay because it's another street there's always another way okay um <laughs> That's why I'm gonna start in the black community and then eventually like work my way up until, un up until like, you know, all genres, all races and stuff, because I do wanna sell to other people as well. You know, tapings, extensions, but right now my focus is just on um, just getting it out there, you know? So I'm dropping um, July 7th, 2024. I'm so excited, y'all. Anyway, yeah, I've been learning hair, learning about um, how to make my hair tags because like the um, the vendors that I've been talking to, they've been saying that they do packaging and labeling and stuff, but I, I want to, you know, like go the easy way. I think, I think a lot of them actually do it for free, <laughs> but um, they don't do hair tags. Like they do wraps and you know, I'm, I'm going to get wraps for sure. But I also want hair tags and then um, packaging. I need to figure out like my packaging and stuff. I'm going to include, it's, it's so much, it's so much. And I don't want to talk too much um, until everything is like set in order and stuff. So I'm just very excited. I've been learning a whole lot, you know, educating myself, you know, about the market, about the business and stuff. You know, getting tips and tricks from people. And um, I just know that this is going to, you know, just be, you know, a great experience, a beautiful journey. And I'm just excited. I'm very confident in myself. I'm very confident in my plan. I'm just confident in me in general. And this isn't just my plan. This is God's plan. This video is all over the place. But anyway, I hope you're having a great day. Keep your prayers up. Stay blessed. And, you know, let's come up. Hey y'all, I'm back again on this thing. Okay, I'm um, 
I'm in Target. Well, I'm about to go in Target right now. Dang, I got too much to carry, though. I got an order to do real quick, but I um brought my laptop because I need a new keyboard. Um, My laptop is a two-in-one. It's a tablet and a laptop, but the keyboard broke. I'm not sure what happened. Um, I think I, had, I just had spilled something on there. So it's just, I just been using a tablet, but I really, really, really need a laptop. So I had brought my laptop and I finna, I was gonna see if they have like, um, if they sell like keyboards, ones that I can, something I can just plug in to my laptop and it'll work. But I have so much stuff, I have so much stuff. I can just bring my work bag. I'm gonna just bring my work bag instead of my purse. So I'm gonna take my wallet out. My work bag heavy as fuck though. Like this shit is fucking heavy. Should I just wait? I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna just go to fucking Walmart or something. So y'all yeah, finna do this order real quick. And then um I'ma uh get back to y'all. When I um I'm probably gonna come back to Target because I feel like they'll just have better selection in walmart so i'm gonna do this order real quick drop it up come back and then y'all gonna see me in target okay it's so like it's weird but it's not weird like recording in public because like i don't care but at the same time people gonna look because they're like oh, okay she's recording but anyway i'm at tj maxx I'm gonna see what they got in here because I need a desk. I need a lamp. I need a desk. I need a lamp. I need light bulbs. My hair is cute. So, are you fine? I'm just finna see what they got in here. And then I'm gonna go to Walmart and see if they um have, if I can find a keyboard for my laptop. These are so cute. I think these are lamps. No, they're not lamps. They're just the core. These are so pretty, though. Don't do so much. I don't think they're going to have a desk in here. Go. Here's a desk. Is that a tag? Part of me feels like this won't be too much and it don't have a tag anyway, so it just means I don't need it. That's a cute color. For my um for my office. Damn TJ. Damn TJ. Off to Wally World. We're trying to go to Wally World. I need a new work bag so bad. This is cool. This is cool. I actually need like a couple things. But I'm really just going to focus on um, a desk. Laptop, a keyboard, and light bulb, and a lamp. My hygiene stuff can actually wait because I really just need body oil, but I already have lotion, so I can wait till tomorrow to get some body oil. And oh, I need makeup wipes too. I gotta get makeup wipes. I gotta get makeup wipes for sure. I need to put my first. I don't know why I went another way just because some people was coming. I'm like, girl, don't be irking. I really can just give me like a little folding table. I really don't mind getting like a folding table. I don't want to get a folding table. So I'm gonna turn around and get an actual desk. If I don't find one today, I'm gonna get one tomorrow. But I hope I find one today because I'm honestly like super impatient. Like when I want something, I want it like right then and there. I really do not like to wait for stuff. 
So like if I don't find a desk, I will fuck around and get a folding table and then turn around and get a um, desk tomorrow. Like just waste the money. But like a folding table wouldn't be bad. <laughs> Here go the desk. <laughs> it's $35. Damn, it's a little desk, $35. I can do this. No, this is perfect. Let me look at my account. <laughs> I can get it for sure. That's why I'm here. But like, I really don't want to uh, transfer any money. That's the thing. Like, I just want to spend what I already have. But like, the desk is like, I don't know how much I was expecting to spend on a, a desk. $10, I don't know why. I got money out that ass though. Like, that shit's so crazy. Okay, I can use this for my makeup wipes and my oil. This was money that was in my purse. What you know about me? What you what you know about me? Let me show y'all what it looked like. It's just a regular desk with two shelves. Like that's perfect. Let me see what else they got though. Why the fuck is this desk two hundred dollars? Oh, this not the desk. That's this. It's seventy five dollars. I'm gonna just use my mama desk because my mama not even using her. I mean, not this. I'm just using my mama chair because she's not even using her chair right now. She don't even use her desk, period. I asked if I can have her desk. She said no. But she don't even use it, so. I'm buying my own. You should. I did not know that's how it looks when you do that. Doing too much. Yeah, I think I'm gonna get this. I'm gonna get it. Cause I can put my fridge on the bottom. My notebooks. The bottom shelf, my fridge, notebooks on the top. And then the actual desk. Put my calendars and boards in front. Just take my mama chair. I need a lamp. Okay, calendar check, desk check, chair check. I need a lamp. I cannot wait to be in a business section, bro. I'm fucking, I'm in the business section. Fuck that. Fuck that. Hold on. Y'all cook it. Ooh. Cause I need to, um, some, um, I need to make business cards. Look. I think I have to put them in a printer though. Yeah. It's 10 cards per sheet. So how many sheets is it? Oh, it's 90 cards in total. 90 cards. Oh, that's not bad. 90 cards for five, $9, I mean $6. But I don't even have like, I don't even have my uh, design yet. Cause I changed my name again. I'm just so excited y'all, you know, like getting into business, starting business. Like I've always knew that I was gonna be in business. I always knew that I was gonna be a boss in general and it's just the fact that like i'm making it happen is what's so exciting and like i just like i could literally cry at any moment and i literally don't even have to do it i can cry just based off of like my mindset i'm trying to think on if i should just if I should take y'all with me while I'm at Walmart, or um, just wait till I get home to set up everything. I feel like I should wait to get home to set up everything. Cause I'm just talking right now, like just talking. I don't know y'all to hear me talk. So I'ma see y'all when I get to the crib to set up everything. I'm back, bro. Like if I'm gonna get the content, I'ma get the content. But this ain't about content though, this is just my life. You know, YouTube is just my life. I just found one. Keyboards. Yes. 
twenty dollars. It's this. They have this. Um, they have one for fifty dollars, and they have one for a hundred dollars. These look like they good. Oh, they're for iPads though. I don't have iPads. Not yet. Do I even need an iPad though? Cause I I, I already have a tablet. And if I could get Canva on my uh, laptop. I mean, I don't have a tablet. I have a tablet in my If I get Canva on my uh, laptop, I don't need no freaking iPad. Okay, so I, I gotta get some batteries, triple A batteries. Yes. So, this is my laptop. And then. my laptop but it turned into a tablet it's pretty cool but the laptop part broke i don't know what happened i think i spilled something on here but i don't even gotta plug nothing up so i can put this together Ooh, what if i stole this i could easily just put this in my bag should i do that god gonna be mad at me this, what is going on? Okay. Like, I'm literally having a conversation with myself right now. Because I really want to take this in. Because, like, why would I pay for a five pack? I don't need five. I just need one. My friend just sent me a plug. And I got some wine at the crib. Look, they got another keyboard. Too. I don't need this big ass cube. Oh, come with the mouse. Come with the mouse, bro. Wait. Literally, because how was I going to use this? How was I going to use this with no mouse? It's just the keyboard. Okay, so I'm going to get this one. This is so big. Hold on. Look, they got the mouse right here. This can't fit in my, um, this can't fit in my, um, purse. So yeah, I'm gonna have to get it. I'm gonna have to get that small one and buy a mouse. Cause this cannot fit in my purse. I want this because it has the mouse, but it won't fit in my purse. I'm gonna open it. This ugly ass, old ass keyboard. ASMR. This can't fit in my purse, and I'm gonna need it in my purse. So, it's like a fine mouse, too. And it came with the batteries. Purple mouse with the um, thing, or should I do black? Black is too black. Black is too simple. They calling something a bitch. So, I'm spending some money in here. I can really get that from my nanny because she is not going to use that. That lamp. She has a lamp at home. She's not going to use that. So, I'm not going to do that. I'm not going to get a lamp because she has a lamp. She not. She don't use it. I just want to spend... Cause I want to, not because I have to. And y'all, like, I think my hair done bad. And it pisses me off because I literally just got my hair done. And the shit looks off, but it's cool. It's cool, it's cool, it's cool. Yeah, I'm trying this new skincare thing. Cleansing my face, doing lemon, and I ordered um, some serum for from the ordinary. Like, so 
Make a white syrup and what the fuck else? I need a water. Body oil. Bend that ass over. Let that coochie burn. Okay. Make up wise body oil. This laptop keyboard. Okay, I need batteries and gallon of water, and I'm done. I don't like um, necklaces that have that on it. They have the extended. I like a necklace that's just one. A lobster cloth. <laughs> a lobster cloth. to get 30 inches to my ass. Shop the rich girl. I'm trying to think of what I got, what we got at the house. I can eat some noodles. I ain't gonna have I love me some high spicy noodles. They ain't even got none. They only got the beef and the shrimp. That's how you know the chicken was fried because they don't have it. Nails did I find this fuck. Y'all, why the fuck is my nail lifting already? I think it's almost been two weeks though. Today I got my nails done on um, Valentine's Day. Valentine's Day. What's today? I think it's the 23rd. So nine days ago. And my nail is lifting a little bit because my hair, the curly hair, gets caught under the nail. Like, I'm about to cuss Maria ass out. Maria cool though, I like her. I need a light bulb. Why is this video so fucking long? I need some burritos. Chicken and cheese burritos, these five. In the oven, extra uh, crispy. I'm gonna go home, fuck that light bulb. I'm gonna go get a light bulb. <laughs> Damn. Might as well get it all done. I cannot keep coming to Walmart cause I'm spending too much fucking money. Whatever I, uh, whatever I uh, spent today, I'll just make tomorrow. But I don't need to be thinking like that all the time. Like, oh, if I spend this, I can just make it back to mom. Like, no, you have to be responsible with your money. Okay. Candle. Candle in my book. And I'm done. I'm bad. I'm chill. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. Lavender makes you go to sleep. Girl, I literally cannot sleep. This is my good. So I can get the fuck out of here. This smells good. This smells good. This is a uh, peak sands. Boom. I remember this book. I don't think it was just about bed. Oh. What? I see a white dog looking at me. A black sheep. I'm a black sheep though. I ain't even no cat. I really am. I see a teacher looking at me. 
Why she look like that? Memories. Light bulb, light bulb, light bulb. Excuse me. What the light bulb be? Light bulb. Um, all the way back where you see the automotive, like where they fix the cars. Okay. Cool, cool. Thank you. I would have never thought to go all the way back there, so. Appreciate that. Slow down, champ. Y'all, I think I'm about to get some weed from the plug. Sorry. Okay, this is the um my bulb that I have. I've never seen a 10 watt before. Like is this even like all of these are 40. The lowest size I see is 25 watt. But a 10 watt, I've never seen a 10 watt before. Anyway, I'm about to um I'm done in Walmart. I think I'm pretty sure I got everything. I'm about to go check out and then I'll see y'all when I get to the crib to set up my area. Bye. What's up, y'all? Back in the crib. I'm about to um set up everything. Well, I'm about to move this dresser into the closet. This is actually my um niece's room. This used to be my room. This was my room. But I turned it into a closet. Um and then I moved in here and then my I had a bed in there but my brother had took it and they just had the bunk bed left so I'm on the bunk bed. I really don't think I need to say all of that. But I said it, so it is what it is. But um, I low-key want to move the bunk bed, but I'm not going to move it. So, um, I'm trying to think of how I want to do this layout. This was everybody's room at one point. Like, first, it was my younger brother's. Then it was mine's. Then I moved out. Then it was my little, little sister. Like, my sister. Um, then it was her room, then she moved out, then it's my niece's room, slash my room, but I don't really count this as my room, because this is my niece's room, this is just where I sleep, but like, my niece, she's not even like three months yet, so, this is my room, this is where I sleep, <laughs> This is her room. Her room is going to be ready. This is all her stuff. That's all her stuff. Her name is Nova. Nova, Nova, Nova. But I really want to get rid of these two. There's nothing in this dresser. And there's nothing in that either. So I'm trying to think of how I want to um move this around so I can set my desk up. I low-key want to move the bunk bed long ways along this wall put the desk right there by the door put the desk right here by the door move the bunk bed long ways um i can really put our diapers and stuff in the dresser move the dresser next to this like scoot it down this would be a whole little project so I'm finna um I'm finna do this y'all. Let me set a timer because I put my burritos in the oven. So yeah, I got my glass of wine. I'm about to play some music and um watch this transformation, y'all. I wanna show y'all a couple of things that's in here though. Like this for starters. This is a painting that my mom did. It resembles me so much because I'm such a bad bitch and I smoke good weed. Okay. This everything that's on this dress is like like my um like my sanctuary basically. 
Got my fridge. And then, I don't know why I have this bottle. This bottle of wine right there. But I just like it. Because it has strawberries. And it's just, it's just nice. I might put some flowers in here. And then this is the champagne that I got on New Year's Eve. Me and my best friend didn't get to pop it. And I took that as a sign as like I should save it. So um, I'm going to pop this on New Year's Eve this year or New Year's Day just to celebrate how amazing this year is going. So this is on there. And then my holy grails, literally. My devotional, I do this every day, every morning. My Bible, read this every morning. My journal, do I I think did I I didn't write in this today. I wrote, I think I wrote yesterday though. Yeah, I wrote yesterday. That just irritated me because what I wrote about, uh uh. I have this book that I attempted to start, but it's just not good to me. Like it just seems like it was written by a kid. Not like he didn't make sense or nothing, but just like it was it did it just wasn't intellectual. But I'm gonna try it though. I'm gonna try it because people have said this is a really, really good book. But it just annoys me when I read it because it just seems like I'm reading it. I'm reading like something that a kid wrote. I'm gonna try it again though. I don't even remember where I left off. But I haven't wrote, I mean, I haven't read this book in months. But it's been sitting right there. And then this is my new journal I bought this months ago. And it says thoughts of sorts. So I just got it um, for when I finish this journal. I already have my new journal. And then this is my shadow work book. I haven't done this in a really long time either, but it's really good. It's cool. But yeah, and then the rest on there is just like my glass of wine and then my cup that has uh, pens and highlighters and stuff in there. And then, hold on. And then this, I'm collecting shot glasses now when I go out of town. So I went to Houston this year. So I got a Houston shot glass and then this rose. My brother got a girlfriend now and for valentine's day he made glitter roses for her and he this was his test one and i asked if i could have it and he let me have it so that's on there and yeah that's it and i got this that says love because i'm full of it <laughs> But anyway, I'm about to get to it, y'all. Watch this transformation, as y'all can see the before. I do too much, but I do not care. Sometimes I be thinking about sleeping at the top, but like for what? I don't want to sleep at the top. I really like, I might sleep at the top one day. I don't know. It just didn't feel right. One time I climbed up there and I was like, this don't feel right. And I got right back down. <laughs>
it is no work for me. Like, this had me toe up, but here it is. Don't buy all that trash. I'm about to put this right here. Finish, and then, y'all, it's literally 2.46 a.m. I have to get up at 8 o'clock. I still have to shower. But this is no work for me. Like, I don't want to be a builder. Um, for future references. My man will be the one who is doing stuff like this. Not me. I'm so excited. See, bro? Like, these... I cannot tighten. Do y'all see it? It looks so nice. I can't wait to get like. Let me not because I'm very grateful. Hey, right here, baby. What y'all think? but it's a lot for me I'm very excited so hey y'all it's so dark okay let's see if I can get there <laughs> I probably finished Smells so good. Trying out new products. Well, it's, uh, it's the same brand, but I got the Sim instead of the face oil. I like this. It's cool. Anyway, I just got out the shower. It is 5:44 in the morning. Let me show y'all final results. Leave the mask. trying to debate on if I should um because I have to get up at 8 o'clock and it's 5 46 I'm trying to debate on if I should just take a quick nap or um or um do the breakfast shift for DoorDash but like I don't feel like it's very obvious that I'm extremely tired but at the same time I don't want to sleep for two hours but I need to go to sleep so I'm gonna go to sleep if you made it this far thank you for watching I know this video is long as heck but I want to edit it tonight but I'm about to K.O. I'm gonna edit it in a car on the way to Nashville but Y'all have a great day and I'll talk to y'all later. Bye.